All right, nail polish review. Now, before I get into the review, let me show you what it looks like. Okay. You see that? My husband has taken to calling me Slimer because of this nail polish. Now, when I bought it, I really like the color. It's vibrant. People comment on it. It really pops. But the polish quality is crap. All right? And I don't know why I expected anything else. I went to Charlotte Russe. And uh, I was there picking up some clothes, you know, and some accessories, some jewelry, I think. Um, and they had nail polish on sale for three for ten dollars. So I was like, oh, why not? You know, but you can't lose three for ten dollars. That's great for nail polish. So I picked it up in these three colors. I got this one. It's like watermelony color. Their their nail polish don't have names either. They're just called nail color. So this one I'm calling watermelon ish, watermelon fuchsia. No, watermelon. This one's fuchsia. Okay. And this one's Slimer. Okay. So I'm going to do a quick review on these. Now, when you buy it, it has a little ball in it. You shake it up. Great. You know, you go to put it on your nails and it's like it's separated. It doesn't matter how much you shake it. It's not a nice, clean coat. You get like dark light, dark light. It's, you definitely can't get away with one coat of this. So then you put on a second coat and honestly look like I painted my nail with a magic marker this nail polish is super super dull like it has no shine no glitter no it looks like nail like marker like I painted my nails with a green marker okay so I'm not really feeling that um, and to spice it up I just put the crackle over it which I'll show you that in a minute but um, so I would not recommend buying the Charlotte Russe nail polish I'm sure you're all smart and you know this but I thought great deal why not but it really is not a good nail polish at all to buy. Sorry, Charlotte Russe. I love your store for other things, but not the nail polish. You guys should stay out of that game. It's, it's not good. It's not the nail polish at all. Um, so, yeah, that's it for Charlotte Russe nail polish. Two thumbs down. Don't buy it. Okay. Um, nail polish update on ones that I've been buying. So you saw those. And then I had two more that I purchased since I did a nail polish video. Um, and this one I bought from my spa, and it's, I don't think I showed you guys this one, Spa Ritual, okay. It, I had it on in one of my Outfit of the Day videos, um, and it's called Free Spirit. And it, it paints on like a nice opaque white, okay, so it's a great color. Okay, and then I went ahead and bought the Crackle Overcoat from Sally Hansen, um, and I know some other companies sell it as Shatter, but... I bought this one, Crackle. And if you want a video on it, I could do a video on it, but there's plenty on YouTube, so I didn't do one showing, you know, how I apply it and whatnot. But I think this is the this one came up the best. Okay. So um that's it for nail polish. It's a quick video. Nail polish update. Don't buy from Charlotte Russe. Sally Hansen Crackle, good. Charlotte Russe, bad. Okay. So I guess I will. I don't know if this is the last video of the day. Maybe. I might be done. We'll see. Talk to you guys later. Bye.